Welcome to Anuga Food Tech India and Anuga Select India, the leading trade shows which showcases the rapid evolution of food and beverage industry. Well, friends, this industry is growing rapidly in India, and the world is looking up to India when it comes to food and beverage. So, be it the agri trade and the fine foods, the dairy products, the packaging, logistics, the processing, or you name it, you will have it. So all the industries are showcasing their products and services here when it comes to food and beverage. I am here at the Bombay Exhibition Center to cover this landmark edition of Anuga Food Tech India, which is happening from 28th to 30th of August. And this edition has more than 1,000 exhibitors participating from more than 46 countries and includes more than 10 international pavilions. It is a big event. And if you are a part of this industry, then you must visit this show which is happening for these three days. The entry is free of cost, but you must register online in case you want to have a hassle-free experience. Today is day one and the event is already bustling with a lot of activity. As the organizer told us that more than 52,000 pre-event registrations happened online. So this is going to be a massive event. Come with me as we will talk to the various exhibitors, participants and we will also speak to the exhibition organizer to understand what are the major highlights of this edition of this landmark show. Come with me. So as we enter the halls of Bombay Exhibition Centre, as we know Bombay Exhibition Centre is a fantastic venue in Mumbai, one of the oldest venues in India and we are welcomed with this mega event. The presence of food and beverage sector companies from across the globe. We see the big companies, we see the food and beverage giants over here and uh, we will move inside to show you the various glimpses of this event. This is the registration area as you can see and if you are coming to attend the event then you have to register first online and if you have to come on site for the event registration. A lot of machineries, food processing machineries are running over here, live demonstrations are going on and international pavilions are being set up over here. As you can see, this machinery, running machinery is there, as you can see the operations. Can you tell us a little bit about this machinery? Anyway, uh, this is the online seasoning system. The product will come from backside. It will get seasoning here and it will get here and after that it will get way, way and it goes for the packaging. Packaging, okay. Yeah. So what are the end uses of this machinery? Where is it used? In which sectors? It is, it is used for the, uh, mostly for the potato chips, then snacks, all kind of namkins. It is all used all over the okay. namkin manufacturing okay. industries. And today you are here at the Anuga Food Tech. This is the first day. How happy you are, how satisfied yeah, yeah. you are. Customers are coming all the way here to see the, our trade show, whatever the machines we have placed here. We are definitely we are happy here. And thank you for your time, all the best. Thank you, thank you. So friends, to tell me more about this edition of Anuga Food Tech and Anuga Select, I have with me Mr. Milin Dixit, the Managing Director of Colon Messe, the organizer of this show. Uh, tell us what have been the highlights of this show. Okay, the highlights mainly I would like to emphasize on the processing, food processing part. We have many new exhibitors this year compared to all our previous edition, thereby increasing the size automatically. But the technological advancements and the new technologies with the, you see the machines running, that is the highlight of the show. Because uh, when you have every stall live machine running, you know, they are giving the demo of packaging, processing, everything. That's a major highlight that I would like to emphasize. And I think this is a hallmark of a successful trade show where we see demonstrations, Correct. touch and feel happening. Correct. And could you tell me a bit about the statistics, how many exhibitors and how many country pavilions and how many countries are participating in, in together? Okay, uh, countries um, over 45 as of day before yesterday, but you can say 45 countries. We have uh, nine country pavilions in the Anuga Select India and uh, we have individual exhibitors in Anuga Food Tech India. So put together we have 45 countries, they are already participating. The highlight of this is Saudi is coming for the first time in our show with a 300 square meter pavilion. That's a highlight I would like to mention because otherwise we have Italy, we have uh, you know other countries, Indonesia, they are there but Saudi is for the first time. Okay. And yeah, they're bringing all their 
uh, dry fruits and everything uh, to market in India. Okay. And if you talk about the potential of growth in this sector, because Anuga, you know, highlights the innovation and growth in this yeah. sector. So yeah. How do you see the promise of this sector for India in the coming one or two years? Amazing uh, growth uh, potential that we see. When I say that, uh, because uh, the ministry, government is doing a lot of things to promote the food processing sector in particular. And uh, there are many schemes that, that they are offering, there are many subsidies they are offering. There are many food parks where uh, food processing is promoted largely by the government. So that is the basic uh, reason that uh, you know the industry is also getting a boost in a way. And they are getting encouraged because there is a lot of funding also is coming from government, a lot of uh, you know subsidies in terms of power and everything is offered to them. There are many startups that are coming uh, in this business. I mean, if you go to Hall 4, there are, uh, we have a startup pavilion oh, wow. for the food companies. We have also subsidized the rates for the startup companies. And uh, of course, so these are some uh, elements yeah. that you can see as the innovations. Mm. And we ourselves as uh, Anuga and uh, Anuga Food Tech, we are seriously promoting these startups mm. because they are the future of the industry. Industry has got tremendous growth potential, I can tell you that. Okay. And uh, Colin Messe is celebrating 100 years journey uh, and today you have uh, industry gathering for the same. Could you tell me what have been the journey like and any message you would like to share with the industry at large? Uh, message is yes, of course, it's with the support of the industry that we've uh, reached that milestone. 100 years is, uh, you know, actually a very big milestone which you will appreciate. You announced the new show launch. Yeah. Could you also tell our audiences about the new show? Yeah, the new show launched is with an in association with APIDA, uh, the Agricultural and Process uh, Food Export Development Authority, as you know. We are partnering with them to launch this show because APIDA is promoting a lot of export for uh, livestock. And there is a lot of potential. India is growing uh, multifold in livestock also but they want to promote the export into it. So thereby we see a good potential. We launched the show in the inauguration with APIDA officials being there. And uh, you know, I, I see a great success. Amazing. Yeah. And this is called, what are the dates and what is the name? India International Livestock Expo. And it is 16 to 18th of April, 2025 at Bombay Exhibition Amazing. Center. Wonderful, we wish you all the best and thank, thank you for you giving so us time. Thank you so much. Hello everybody, my name is Dennis Steker. I'm the Senior Vice President International of Köln Messe GmbH in Germany. And we are very proud to inaugurate today our Anuga Select India and our Anuga Food Tech India show duo uh, here today in India in Mumbai. On the occasion of our 100th anniversary of a century of Köln Messe, we are rebranding our shows into Anuga and Anuga Food Tech. And we are sure that this will boost again the interest in the show here for the entire region and it boosts a lot of opportunities for both exhibitors and visitors alike. Thank you for joining us. So my, my name is Sanjay Singhal and the CEO of Vag Bakri at uh, Tea Group. Uh, I've always made a point to every year attend Anuga in India and sometimes in Cologne also because I think that uh, leading edge technology and new product ideas only come when you interact with industry colleagues especially machine manufacturers. Uh, so, uh, I'm really looking forward to spending uh, today uh, understanding uh, what is happening in the industry, especially in machine learning, in, in using AI, in using uh, various applications for uh, manufacturing. So, my best wishes to all the participants. I hope you find it very fulfilling and a learning opportunity. Hi, Thank you. I'm Rasika and I'm from Voyage India and we have a brand of rice, uh, Thai Jasmine, Home Mali uh, Jasmine Rice. Uh, Arborio rice, Kurturiso is a brand and Moshi Moshi Sushi, that's a sushi rice. So we are, uh, this is our, these are all imported rice that we have. And uh, this is the second time we are participating here in Anuga Select. Earlier it was Anu Foods and uh, it has really helped us grow, uh, reach a uh, lot of audience, a lot of people from different uh, industries of restaurants and uh, hotels distributors so yeah we had a, a really good experience so far today it was the first day of aduga select here 
and the football is great though it's raining outside but there are a lot of people who has turned up uh, from various areas and we had a nice day as of today Hello, friends uh, i am santosh hargude i am a sales head for food and pharma segments vika instruments is a german based company and having a world class manufacturing of pressure temperature level force flow measuring instruments and uh, it is having headquarter in germany and manufacturing plant in pune gaziabad faridabad and chennai and uh, we are dealing with the food and pharma industries also uh, with a special technology and very high quality of the products and uh, uh, this anuga exhibition is uh, really a giving good opportunity to sell our product in this industries because lot of pharma equipment uh, food uh, processing equipment manufacturers are there in in the in this exhibition who are our end customers and end uh, who are our customers so our, our product can be utilized by them and it, they will it, they will get the benefits with the precise quality and uh, international quality and with the reliable price and uh, we we will ready to support in all directions thank you very much hello my name is suhas and i am from the koesha india company Uh, we are an Italian based company and uh, we have multiple uh, uh, business vertical in it one of the business vertical what we are presenting here is a uh, automation and a conveying division on my left side you can see we have the robotic palletizer which is a collaborative uh, palletizer and the uh, man and machine can work together then back side you can see the big uh, unit which is a spiral conveyor Uh, which is used to create the aisle and uh, to transfer the product vertically upside and you can see the other uh, alpine solutions and maybe the food grade hygiene conveyor so this is uh, uh, the one uh, basically goes into the food industry where naked food can be handled uh, i think that we are participating in many exhibitions basically to demonstrate our technology and build our uh, brand image so certainly this kind of exhibition will help us but obviously maybe uh, next 6 months we will come to know how many leads we have got and how much is the relevant lead so that will give the clear idea but yes uh, exhibition we know it's a useful uh, event to grow the business and to make a brand image yeah myself mr ali from gujarat my company name is shafia pur company we are dealing in honey pure honey and we have five types of floral honey Uh, ranging from uh, we have cedar honey lychee honey multiflora honey rosewood honey and himachal multiflora honey we are collecting from different parts of india and it's a pure and natural honey yeah due to exhibitions uh, as per my experience uh, we are getting lots of uh, foreign customers also and from domestic also we are getting the good customers and the flow in anuga it's uh, really very good the kind of customers we are getting that is a very 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 good customers we are getting these days actually uh, we have uh, the floral honey itself is the uh, main factor that uh, we are uh, collecting we have honey bees boxes and we are collecting uh, different different uh, honey from different uh, parts of india and the we have uh, one uh, we have inf infused not infused but we have uh, mixed the dry fruits and honey that will be the our uh, you know the boost boosting products of our products um, my message is that uh, you have to uh, participate exhibit in uh, this anuga food actually we are really we are getting the customers from all over india and from uh, abroad also so uh, my request is to uh, exhibit and if you want to visit then you have to definitely visit this expo for the food business